Hello everyone, happy Wednesday, happy hump day. I feel like it's been so long since I've seen you guys. I hate not getting to stream on Mondays. It sucks, but I had to work my other job on Monday. It is what it is. We are back today though for some spooktober fun games. We are playing Undertale, and this is my very first playthrough ever of this game. I've seen, I think Markiplier do like a pacifist run through, but I don't really remember much of it. I'm not even gonna claim to understand any of the lore behind this, even though I have seen MatPat's game theories. I know there is a heck of a lot put into this game, but we are going to experience it for ourselves for the first time right now, and we I think I'm gonna go with a pass this playthrough. We'll see, we'll see. But let's let's hop into it. See what we think of the game firsthand. We're gonna call our player Daisy, because why not? Oh my god, if I could control this. <laughs> Here we go. Two more letters. S Y Daisy. That is correct. Let's do it. I know Flowey is one of the, the enemies in this. That is not why I picked the name Daisy. Hey, that's us. It's us. It's Daisy. Let's go, Daisy. Let's explore this underground world of Undertale. Hey, there's Flowey. Howdy, I'm Flowey. Flowey the flower. Hehehe. <laughs> why do you make me introduce myself? It's rude to act like you don't know who I am. Someone ought to teach you proper manners. I guess little old me will have to do. Ready? Here we go. Oh boy, are we jumping right into our first battle? See that heart? That's your soul. It's v the very culmination of your being. Your soul starts off weak, but you can grow strong if you gain a lot of LV. I'm assuming that's love. I was right. It is love, of course. You want some love, don't you? Don't worry. I'll share some with you. That's not love. I think that's an attack. Down here, love is shared through little white friendliness pellets. Uh, I don't think Flowey's telling us the truth, folks. Something sounds a little fishy to me. Are you ready? Are you ready, kids? Aye, aye, Captain. Hey, buddy, you missed them. Let's try again, okay? No, I'm trying not to get hit by this. This is bad. That, that takes health. Uh, he looks like he's starting to get a little angrier. That concerns me. Is this a joke? Are you brain dead? Run into the friendliness pellets. They're not friendly. Oh god, what is with his face? Wow, this analog stick is so sensitive. My god. Like, I barely tilt it and she just, the heart just starts moving in that direction. I gotta lower the sensitivity. That's absurd. You know what's going on here, don't you? You just wanted to see me suffer. Oh boy. Oh no, it's much smaller now. Die! I don't want to die. Please, no. Don't let me die. Don't do it. Don't do it. Oh god, oh god. Hey, we survived. What happened? Who is that? Oh, bye, Flowey. Oh, it's this person. Um, Azriel, I think? What a terrible creature, torturing such a poor, innocent youth. Ah, do not be afraid, my child. Toriel, that's the name. I was close, I was close. Caretaker of the Ruins. I pass through this place every day to see if anyone has fallen down. You are the first human to come here in a long time. Come, I will guide you through the catacombs. This way. Okay, can I, can I edit the analog settings now? Uh, no, I don't know how. Okay, I guess we're just gonna leave Mezes. What is this star thingy? Is this a save point? The shadow of the ruins looms above, filling you with determination. HP fully restored. Let's save. Heck yeah. We got our first save file going. Welcome to your no new home, innocent one. Allow me to educate you in the operation of the ruins. Ooh, look at that. There's a hidden passcode. The ruins are full of puzzles. Ancient fusions between diversions and door keys. One must solve them to move from room to room. Yo, I love puzzles. Puzzles are my stuff. That's why I love puzzle games. Please adjust yourself to the sight of them. Do I get to enact your puzzle? No? That's it? Can I go this way? No? How about you? Can I... I can't do anything with you. Can I read you? Only the fearless may proceed. Brave ones, foolish ones, both walk not the middle road. To make progress here, you will need to trigger several switches. Do not worry, I have labeled the ones that you need to flip. How kind. 
press... Okay, well, uh, I am not using a keyboard, so these controls aren't gonna matter for me. Stay on the path. What if I want to go in the water? Oh, I can't go in the water. Alright, I'm assuming she wants us to hit that switch. And don't hit this one, guys, in case you couldn't tell. You don't want the one on the right. You want the one with the arrows pointing at it and the path pointing up to it. As if that was not obvious. Splendid. I am proud of you, little one. Let us move to the next room. Let's do it. Keep hitting me with these puzzles. As a human living in the underground, monsters may attack you. You will need to be prepared for this situation. However, worry not. The process is simple. When you encounter a monster, you will enter a fight. While you are in a fight, strike up a friendly conversation. Stall for time. I will come to resolve the conflict. Practice talking to the dummy. Let's do it. Let's talk to this dummy. You encountered the dummy. What are we going to do? Fight? Ah, oh, hello? Why can't I choose anything? Oh, uh, wait, I don't want to fight, though. What's going on? Dummy stands around you ap- Stands around absent-mindedly. How do I- what, How do I choose something else? Oh, there we go, there we go. I want to- Act. Dummy. Talk. You talk to the dummy. It doesn't seem much for conversation. Toriel seems happy with you. You won, and earned no XP. Yeah, so I think that's one of the downsides of playing the pacifist run-through, is that we're not going to level up at all, which means we're going to stay at the same health we're at. This is a, there's another puzzle in this room. I wonder if you can solve it. Let's find out. Anything hidden behind these vines? No? Nothing hidden in the vines? Alrighty, let's follow Toriel. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Frog, it attacks you. Let's act on Frog, it, and we're going to compliment him. Frog it didn't understand what you said, but she was flat- oh, but was flattered anyway. Well, I'm glad we flattered them. Uh-oh. Hey, we stalled for time long enough, Toriel came and bailed us out. You won! You earned zero XP and zero- okay, I'm not gonna read that line anymore, it's probably gonna pop up literally every single time we do this. Okay, let's keep going. Uh-oh, spikes. Uh, hello, Toriel, I cannot get past you. This is the puzzle, but... Here, take my hand for a moment. Aw, oh, she's just guiding us through the puzzle. What a nice motherly figure. That's not a bad puzzle. Seems pretty easy to me. But thanks for solving it for us. Yo, what's up, Karate Mom? Welcome with those Cooper emotes. I love seeing them bounce around my screen. You have done excellently thus far, my child. However, I have a difficult request to ask of you. I would like you to walk to the end of the room by yourself. Forgive me for this. Oh no, she's ditching us! How dare she! Don't you ditch us like this? Who knows what monsters lie about? This is a long room. Why would you leave me, Toriel? In this dastardly room with absolutely nothing in it but just a long hallway. Also, I love this music. I know the creator of this game made all the music himself. And... Damn, he's got some musical skills. Ah, uh, what we got here? Why are you saying dot dot dot? Are you hiding behind the Oh, you are hiding behind there. You little sneaky. Greetings, my child. Do not worry, I did not leave you. I was merely behind this pillar the whole time. Thank you for trusting me. However, there was an important reason for this exercise. To test your independence. I must attend to some business, and you must stay alone for a while. Please remain here. It's dangerous to explore by yourself. I have an idea. I will give you a cell phone. If you have a need for anything, just call. Be good, alright? Alrighty, we are on our own. Let's completely ignore her advice and go explore. Hello, this is Toriel. You have not left the room, have you? There are a few puzzles ahead that I have yet to explain. It would be dangerous to try and solve them yourself. Be good, alright? Alrighty, let's let's see if we can face this, this frog it have some advice for you about battling monsters. Oh, what? He's a friendly uh, froggit. We don't get to fight him, even though we're doing the pacifist run through anyway. If you act a certain way or fight until you almost defeat them, they might not want to battle you, any battle you anymore. If a monster does not want to fight you, please use some mercy, human. Ribbit. Alright, let's save. HP fully restored. Okay, now, do we go up or down? Uh-oh! It's another frog it! Let's act! And we're gonna check. 
Oh, uh, okay. That is not what I meant to do, but alright. Ribbit, ribbit. Stay away from me with that attack. He missed. Haha. Alright, let's not threaten him. Let's compliment him again. They're not gonna understand, but they're flattered. I'll take it. Blushes deeply. <laughs> Another frog attack. You missed, buddy. Try again. Let's compliment them again. I don't want to threaten them. Come on. We're gonna we're gonna flatter him into uh into to what is it called? Retreating. Your frog attack does not work well. What if we threaten him? He didn't understand what you said, but was scared anyway. Shiver, shiver. Oh shoot! Oh shoot! I almost got hit by that attack. Rocket seems reluctant to fight you. Hey, nice. Mercy? Spare. You won! Hey! We won and we didn't even have to fight. Let's go! This pacifist ending is gonna be so easy. He says in the very beginning, extremely confident. Oh no! Oh no, where am I? Let's go through this door. This just takes us straight back up. Is that it? <laughs> okay. I thought there would be more to this room. Uh-oh, uh-oh! Who we got now? It's another Froggit! Let's compliment him over and over again. And dodge the fly attack. Oh shoot, oh shoot. <laughs> there were a bunch of them there for a sec. Hello, come on. No, act. There we go. Compliment twice, and then threaten a third time. Are you gonna jump at me? No, nope, you're sending flies my way. Act. No, nope, uh, that's not what I meant to do, but alright. That's cool. Croak, croak, croak. Just keep making your- Oh, whoa, that was close. How did I not get hit there? No, what the heck? This stupid analog stick. It's too much. Meow. What? Why did a frog just meow at me? Okay, here we go. Compliment. There we go. He didn't understand, but he was flattered. Are you done fighting me? Have you had your fun? Oh, no, I got hit. Shoot. Oh, he seems reluctant to fight us. Great, great, great. Okay. Give me mercy. Spare. Yes. Okay, so as soon as they say they're reluctant to fight us, we can spare them. Hello, this is Torio. For no reason in particular, which do you prefer? Cinnamon or butterscotch? I prefer cinnamon. Oh, I see. Thank you very much. Again, another call. You do not dislike butterscotch, do you? I know what your preference is, but... Would you turn would you turn up your nose if you found it on your plate? Right, right, I understand. Thank you for being patient, by the way. I have no problem with butterscotch. I used to eat those candies as a kid. I would try and get like the butterscotch uh, lollipops, the dum-dums. Oh, those were so good. Three out of four gray rocks, recommend you push them. Alright, so let's push three out of four gray rocks. There's one. Oh no! It's gonna be another froggit! Alright, froggit, you're gonna get complimented the heck out of you. Now we just gotta dodge. I have to say, I kind of like dodging the attacks, but I know I know it's gonna get significantly harder towards the end, which I'm kind of excited for, because these froggit ones are pretty easy to dodge. So, I'm definitely looking forward to more diverse enemies and fighting. However, I am still very nervous for how hard it's gonna be to dodge some of these attacks in the end. Especially, like, Flowey in the final battle. Oh, please, God, no. Okay, we should be good to spare him after this. Wait, wait, wait. Frogget seems reluctant. Perfect. Okay. Spare. Easy win. Hey, we're actually getting gold now. Awesome. Okay. I didn't know we could actually get gold from this. Uh, hello? What happened? That was weird. Okay. Where's the other... Wait, it said there were three out of four rocks. Oh, no! Where have we fallen to? Oh, there's like a whole extra room here. What does this say? Please don't step on the leaves. Well, who's gonna stop me, huh? You're just a sign. Oh no. <laughs> I love how when I'm not walking on the leaves, I get the uh, froggit attack. Send your worst at me, froggit. I keep wanting to say ribbit, not froggit. Ah, dang it, I got hit. I can't believe, it, there's gotta be some way to get more health because I can't imagine going through this entire game with 20 health. But I know it's possible. I know it is 100% possible. Alright, maybe I won't use the analog stick. Maybe I'll just use the D-pad, because it's a little bit easier to control. I'm 
walking in the leaves sign. What you gonna do about it? Nothing. There ain't nothing here. Alright, we gotta find our path through this. Oh, nope. Almost at it. There we go. Let's get out of here. Oh, no. Another battle. Oh, there's two of them. Froggit and Wims Wimson drew near. Let's get rid of the Froggit first. We'll compliment the Froggit. Like we always do. But now we gotta dodge two attacks, don't we? Oh god. Oh god, yes we do. Oh, this is a lot more difficult now. Okay, we need to get rid of Froggit right now. Stay in the middle. Just chill right in the middle. Oh god, oh god. These are these are new attacks. Okay, uh wait wait wait, what's the Froggit? He seems reluctant. Okay, mercy, spare. Hey! We got rid of both of them, let's go. No killing in this playthrough. Not on my watch. Oh, dang it. Do we have to go all the way down to the bottom there? Okay, what if we try actually not walking in the leaves? Will this stop the spawn of monsters? Oh, my lord. What in the heck? I don't even know what the right path is anymore. I'm pretty sure... What? Oh, dang it. I was like, I fell again? I didn't even step on the platform. But no, it was just a froggit. These froggit fights are going to get super old real quick. Frog attack is literally so easy to skip. Sweet. Let us continue exploring. This thing looks. There we go. Alright, so I'm pretty sure these are safe to walk on. Yes. Okay. I want to get on that flower patch over there. Or the leaves. What do you say? Didn't you read the sign downstairs? <laughs> course. No! Shoot, it was so close! That sucks. Alright, screw the signs. We don't need to worry about what the signs say. We're a rule breaker. Who needs the rules? Not me. No! Okay, Froggit. Time to blush. There you go. Blush deeply. Stay away, flies! Stay away! Second compliment. Maybe we can spare him after this. Oh, send the frog at me. Actually, that one was pretty close. That's the closest I've ever seen that frog attack get to actually damaging me. Okay, here we go. I think I got the path this time. No, it was just up a little bit higher. Alright, we're gonna end up having another frog at fight. <laughs> Ain't that great. Oh, I can't even figure out where this freaking path is. Actually, you know what? Let's let's console the Wimson. Halfway through your first word, Wimson bursts into tears and runs away. Perfect. Now it's just the ribbon. Maybe we can spare him after this attack. Oh, God dang it, that was really stupid of me. Nope, he did not want to be spared. That's cool. He hops to and fro. Let's compliment him once more. Maybe then we can leave. Here we go, here we go. Oh shoot! Dang it, that should not have hit me. I should have gone down faster. I don't know why that attack got me. Okay, please, can we make it through this path? I'm gonna try and thread the needle with those two holes I made at the very end, because I'm pretty sure that's the right path. Go up and around this, and then you just go right through here. No, what the heck? What the heck? Those two holes are even touching. Doesn't make sense. I wonder if I just threaten him the whole way. I guess I shouldn't though. I, I know pacifist is you don't do any damage or you don't kill anyone. I think it's you don't kill anyone. Um, but I don't know what uh, threat would do if anything. Okay, I really need to heal after this battle. I've been taking a lot of damage. What the heck? That fly spawned out of nowhere. That's not fair. No, I'm kidding. It's totally fair. I just got screwed over. Let's not die. How about that? We're going to try and make it through this path without dying. Because that would be quite ideal. We're literally right at the end of the path, too. I just cannot get it to load. Not load, but I can't get it to 
function properly. Is it all the way down? It's all the way down. Okay, that's cool. That's cool. You know, this 8-bit uh, style of game kind of reminds me of the Harry Potter and the Chamber of Secrets game I had back on my Game Boy. That was so much fun, walking around the castle and everything. Oh my god. That game brings back some nostalgia. Okay, that was good. Send me the frog attack. You can never hit me with that. Nope, it's gonna be the flies. Nope, it's gonna be the frog. Let's go. We're safe. Mercy! Okay, here we go. We got it this time. We know the path. We're gonna go down here. Go up and around. Go all the way down. Oh, you've gotta be joking. You literally gotta be kidding me. <laughs> oh my god. There's gonna be one more froggit. Yep, yeah, there it is. Oh, it's both of them. Alright, let's do the wins in the game. We'll console him. Halfway through your first part, he bursts into tears and runs away. Let's go. Do your worst, froggit. Do you seem reluctant to fight me? Good. Okay, then maybe we can spare him. Nope, that did not work. He doesn't even know why he's here and he's still trying to attack me. Wait, wait, what did he say? You were intimidated by Froggit's raw strength. Only kidding. No, he won't let me spare him. Froggit, please. What you doing, Froggit? You're killing me. Okay, well, we gotta compliment him, I guess. We cannot spare him until we compliment him. We're safe. Oh, whoa, that actually got really close. There we go. Gotta wait for that keyword of reluctant. That's the only way you can get through these battles. Okay, let's do this. For real this time. Go up. Go all the way down. All the way over. Thank God. That took way too long. Wait. That sign said we had to move three out of four rocks. Oh, no. Shoot. You tripped into a line of mold smalls? What in the world? Let's flirt. You wiggle your hips. Mold Small wiggles back. What a meaningful conversation. Squarch. Burble blub. Oh god. Okay, okay. It's all about that pattern recognition. Can we, uh, let's, let's flirt with B. Yeah, everyone's gonna wiggle at each other. Cool. <laughs> a sexy wiggle. Oh, alright, that's new. Whoa, 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 whoa. What is this exploding stuff? Is it ruminating? Can we spare them? Alright, perfect. We really need to get through this room and get a heal. Okay, let's push them all on. We need to take some of them off. We can. Go. Whoa there, partner. Who said you could push me around? Hmm? So you're asking me to move over? Okay, just for you, pumpkin. Oh my god, this is actually a sentient rock that don't doesn't want to move. You want me to move some more? Alrighty, how's this? No, that's the wrong direction, you dummy. Hmm, that was the wrong direction? Yes, you're literally, you're taking the words directly from my mouth. Now, if you could just move to the simple, the gray button that is to your right, to the, the, the southeast. It's not that far. You can do it, I believe in you. You think you got it? All right. Oh, oh, oh! Good job, buddy. Was that helpful? Yes, it was. I'm proud of you. Can I actually, can I push you? No, you're just gonna say that over and over again. Okay, that's cool. Real, hey, 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 what do you think you're doing? Yes, I want you to stay there. You're trying to get me killed. Alright, there we go, we made it. Save point, let's go! Heal me! Knowing the mouse might one day leave its hole and get the cheese, it fills you with determination. I think determination is a big part of this game. This cheese has been here quite a long time. It's stuck to the table, that's gross. Oh look, there's a little mouse hole right here. That's even cuter. There's a little sound effect when you go up to the hole and press X. That's so cute. I love it. Alright, now that we are fully healed, why is there a ghost on the floor? He's asleep. Mr. Ghost, can you wake up? Are they gone yet? This ghost keeps saying Z out loud repeatedly. <laughs> oh my god. Move it with force? No, we're not gonna move it with force. We gotta find another way past him. Alright, we might have to move it with force. I guess that is part of the pacifist way. Moving objects and people with force. Okay, here we go. Move it with force. Yes. Uh-oh. Here comes Nap Stab Look? Is that, like, Naps as in plural and then Tab Look? Or Nap singular and then Stab Look? I don't know. Very weird. 
Let's uh, let's flirt with him. We're gonna just flirt with every enemy. I just weigh you down. Oh no, he's crying. Not the crying attacks. I walked right into that one. Napstab look is staring into the distance. What are you looking at? Let's let's cheer him up. How about that? You give Napstab look a. Uh, uh, we're gonna just call him Naps. How about that? We'll call him Naps. We gave him a patient smile. Huh. That's it? That's all you got for me? I really not feeling up to it right now, sorry. He just he's having a he's having a down day. He looks a bit better. Let's cheer him up again. You told Naps a little joke. And he laughed. Yay! Oh no, you're still crying though. Okay, this is less tears though. He seems happier. Cheering seems to have improved Napstap's look. Let's spare him. No, no sparing. Okay, that's cool. What in the world kind of tears are those? Holy, what the heck? Oh my god. Let's, uh, let's flirt again. No, he's just sad again. Dang it. These are definitely fewer tears than the first attack, though. That's, that's good. I think, I think that's promising. Let's cheer him up one more time. He wants to show us something. Let me try. What are you gonna show me? What? You can make your tears float upward? <gasps> He's making a hat! I call it Dapper Book. Do you like it? I do like it. That looks awesome. He eagerly awaits our response. Let's, uh, cheer. Oh, gee. Oh, wait, why were there two tears there? Two, two little stray tears came down to try and hit me. I usually come to the ruins because there's nobody around. But today, I met somebody nice. Oh, I'm rambling again. I'll get out of your way. Okay, bye, Mr. Ghost. Bye, Naps. What's up here? Frog it. Probably a helpful one. Did you miss it? Spider bake sale down into the right. Come eat food made by spiders for spiders of spiders. Oh boy, that's a lot of spiders. Let's see what they got. Anything on the menu for humans? No, there's some, some webs. Leave seven gold in the web? Uh, how many gold do I have? I have 24 gold? Oh, wait, wait. What am I getting out of this? Spider bake sale. All pre proceeds go to, s to real spiders. What? What about here? Leave 18 gold in the web. Why would I do this? Let's do the small one. Because I I feel like maybe we'll get something out of it. Some spiders crawled down and gave you a donut. Awesome. Can I check that? No, it's a spider donut. That's cool. Spider donut. Heals 12 HP. A donut with spider cider in the batter. Alright, well at least it heals 12 HP. That's cool. Alright, what do you guys got to say? Your friend never listens to you. Whenever I talk, they skip through my words by pressing X. Okay, so for me that's not X, that's circle, but that's good to know. Awesome, okay, so we can kind of skip through text. These are just like, regular, uh, like, tips just for the game itself, so we don't need to listen to those. Hello! I just realized that it has been a while since I've cleaned up. I was not expecting to have company so soon. There are probably a lot of things lying around, lying about here and there. You can pick them up, but do not carry more than you need. Someday, you might see something you really like. You will want to leave room in your pockets for that. Okay, good to know. Hey, we got another battle. It's a... My Gosp? My Gosp crawled up close. What? Let's, uh... Let's talk to him. I don't care! Oh god, oh god. Don't hurt me. Don't hurt me, please. He's burbling quietly. Let's try again. Let's talk with him again. No, he really doesn't care. All right, maybe we should just ignore him. Go for the uh, the slime thingy. Let's let's burble with him. Let's uh. No, I don't want to intimidate. I want to flirt. We wiggle our hips. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. I'm like mashing up songs in my head right now. I was thinking of two very different songs. Is ruminating. Can we spare him? Hey, we spared one. Being me is the best. Oh no, what is that attack? Uh, okay. Doesn't have a care in the world. That, that's cool. Can we talk now? Hiya! Hey, he actually talked to us. Hey, what's up, dude? Alright, I think he's done attacking. Yeah, there we go. <laughs> he just kind of danced twice in a row. I figured he was done attacking us. Alrighty, let us continue. What do you got to say? There's just one switch. Cool. Can we go down here? What's in the room below? Oh, oh, what is this? Oh no, it's an enemy. <laughs> Vegetoid came out of the earth. Can we eat the Vegetoid? Talk? Did we can devour him? <laughs> you tried to eat Vegetoid, but it wasn't weakened enough. 
part of a complete breakfast. Uh, I'm pretty sure carrots are not part of a complete breakfast. Maybe a dinner? But not breakfast. Alright, let's, let's talk. Plants can't talk, dummy, but you're literally talking right now. Oh my god, no! Oh my god, no! That was bad. I'm gonna be so bad at this game, guys. Dinner? You pat your stomach. Vegetoid offers a healthy meal. Eat your greens! What if I don't want to eat my greens, huh? Oh, shoot, there's actually greens. I think I should have gotten that green. Give a mysterious smile. Are we done? Nope. You got another green one for me? Oh shoot, oh shoot. I am gonna die. I'm gonna die. Alright, we need that spider donut already. Don't worry, spider didn't... Uh... Sp spider didn't? What? I... Okay, cool. Farmed locally. Very locally. That makes it sound like you're creating it yourself, which is very odd. You can talk, you're just refusing to. Oh my god, I can't avoid these things. They're so hard to avoid. He just does not want to talk with me at all. Maybe I should try that dinner one again. Because he said something about your greens. Yeah, eat your greens. Give me that green one. Throw the green one at me. Yes, I got it. What did that do for me? Here for my health. There we go. Alright, so with Vegetoid... We should always do the dinner one and just grab that green one, and then we should be able to mercy him. I don't know if that's correct or not, but that worked. There is a switch if we go... Dang it. We gotta fall on that next hole. Alright, alright, we know what we're doing now. Let's do dinner. Give me your greens. Yeah, that's it, that's it. Oh, I missed it. Dang it. Okay, we'll have to do the eat your dinner again. Okay, give me that green. Here we go, got it. Good. He cackles softly. Can we do that again? Eat your greens. I will eat all of the greens you throw at me, sir. If I can. Ooh, that was close. That was close. Wait, what is he? He's here for our help. Perfect. It's all we need is him to be here for our help. Okay, now if we fall down this hole, there's a switch here. Perfect. Okay, uh, what about these bottom holes? Let's check out. Check it out. Oh, our Mr. Ghost friend is here. Uh, and there's another vegetable down there. I fell down a hole. Now I can't get up. Go on without me. Wait. Ghosts can fly, can't they? Oh, well. Oh, bye, Mr. Ghost. Okay, I think we got the only switch we needed, so we can continue or not. We got two of them. No, no, no fighting. No fighting. Let's flirt. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Wiggle, wiggle, wiggle. Okay, then we can avoid everything or not. Just, just get hit. That's cool. Let's, uh, let's talk. Yeah, you don't care. I know you don't care. It's gonna take a little bit of persuasion to get you. Damn, these are hard. Uh, no, we can leave that. Let's talk. Continue talking to him. Grab, grab it. Okay, okay, okay. Good. Wait pensively. Let's flirt again. Wiggling our hips at him. Filthy single minder. Ah! Stay away from me. Okay, me. Yes, we got one of them. Nothing like alone time. Okay, so I think this guy just likes when he's the only bad guy here. Yeah, he does. <laughs> I'm pretty sure that's how he works. <laughs> sweet, sweet, sweet. Let's go on. What is you? It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. Alright. What about you? It's a switch. Press it. Yes. Nothing happened. All right. Cool. What do you say? The far door is not an exit. It simply marks a rotation in perspective. Excuse me? What in the world is that supposed to mean? Uh, Luke's. Luke's drawn here. Let's not pick on him. Don't pick on. Finally, someone gets it. Oh, hello. Uh, all right. There's a strange attack you got there. Staring right through us. We're just gonna keep continuing to not pick on him. Make them feel happy about themselves. No bullying in this game. When will your demeanor change though? <laughs> oh my god, those speed up really fast. Gnashes its teeth. Let's try again. Okay, I do not like this attack because they start to speed up very quickly. Staring right through me. Can we, can we spare him? All right, we're good. I don't really know what his cue is for being able to spare, but we did it. <laughs> So that's good. What do these buttons do, though? Nothing, ha nothing happens with any of these switches. 
which is very odd. I feel like something's supposed to happen. Okay, let's keep going. See if there's anything in the next room. So that, that's very odd. Why would they put three switches there if like, none of them did anything? Oh, there's a switch behind here! You hear a clicking sound. That was totally by chance, as of two. I did not know there would be a switch there. That was pretty awesome. A pair of Vegetoids. Oh boy. Let's, uh, take, take you to dinner. Eat your greens and fresh morning taste. All right, where's my green? There's, I missed the green. No, we died. <gasps> oh no. Poor Daisy. Shoot, how far back does that set us? You cannot give up just yet. Daisy, stay determined. I'll stay determined. We haven't even met Sans yet. Can I respawn? Perfect. Okay. I don't know how far back this sets us. Uh, a little bit far. <laughs> okay, let's go through all this really quick. I'll try and catch us up to where we left off as fast as I can. Because we actually we lost a, a good deal of progress. No, no fighting. We are going to cheer him up. We give him a patient smile. How kind of us. See, there's way more tears in the beginning here. But once he starts to cheer up, there's less tears. Told him a little joke. Yeah, that's right. You give me a little laugh and a smile. That's okay if you're not feeling up to it. Naps a lot. You can do whatever you want. Let's cheer him up again. He wants to show us something. Hey, we're already at the, the tear hat. Awesome. Dapper Bluke. You look very dapper, my friend. Let's, uh, let's mercy. Nope, that's it. What, you're still attacking me? Dude, I told you jokes. Cheer once more. There you go, okay, now we're free. I forgot I didn't have to spare him there, I just had to, like, end the fight. Okay, goodbye. We'll meet up with you again soon. Uh, right, let's go back in here. Purchase this again, because this was really helpful. Now we can head back through this room. Don't talk to any of the froggets, because there's no need. Hello, hello. Yes, I know there are stuff to clean up and pick up, and I have limited space in my pockets. Alright, let's get the mold small out first. We gotta flirt with him once or twice. And then the, this big bat on the right will calm down. Ooh, that was close. Nope, uh, that's not what I meant to do. Shoot. Click and do fast. Gotta be more patient. Ooh, that was close. That was not close. That was bad. Okay, there's our second flirt. We should be able to spare after this now. Okay, this one I like. We're usually pretty decent right in the middle. Spare him. Swing your arms, baby. That's right. Celebrate all you want. Alright, spare. Here we go. Easy fight. Let's keep going. Okay, let's not fall on that one. We're gonna fall in you. And we're gonna talk to our ghost friend. And you can fly away now, and hopefully we'll find you later on in the level. Okay, goodbye. Now we'll fall in here. And we'll hit that switch. Go on back up. And get into the battle. Yep, saw that coming. Kind of unavoidable. No, why did I check? God dang it. Okay. Let's dodge all the attacks. Look at this. We barely even have to move. Good. Let's flirt this time. Sexy wiggle. Oh god. Oh god. Okay. Stay away from me. Good. Give it one more flirt before we mercy rule it. Okay. I think we are good right here. Look at this. We don't even have to move. Wait defensively. There we go. You can celebrate all you want, dude. I'll get up nice and close to you. Bye bye. Okay, on to the next room. We're basically back where we were now, but there's a hidden button behind this pillar. There we go. Yes, press it. We hear a clicking sound. Alright, what else can we activate now? What about you? What just happened? Oh my god, what? Where am I? Why did I fall in the random hole that was not there? That was so weird. Okay, let's try hitting the red button again. Because I think the one I hit behind the pillar was red. No, nothing. What about you? Nothing. There's gotta be some pattern with these switches. 
Nothing. Alright, back into the second room. Or not. A Lux! What do we have to do with the Lux? Don't pick on it. Right, 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 right. Just keep not picking on it. Oh, whoa, that was close. Alright, this attack is actually a little bit easier to dodge than that other one he does. One more. Ah, no! I know! He's gazing at us. Let's spare him. There we go. Goodbye, Mr. Lukes. Okay, so what happens if we hit this button again? Just you, you hear a clicking sound. That's it. Okay. Can we physically get near this button? Nope. Okay, anytime we press that button, we fall down. Cool. Don't press the green button. Got it. What about... You noticed there was a blue switch behind the top pillar. Yeah, I already got the blue switch back there. What about you? Okay. Um, I'm not really sure what we're supposed to be doing with these switches. But okay. Maybe that blue switch unlocked this door. If you can read this, press the blue switch. Alright, yeah, that, that's it. We're just overthinking things is all. What does this one say? If you can read this, press the red switch. It's a good thing we can read. Let's press that. Perfect. It is gone. Those spikes are gone. And we are in another fight. Flirt away. What a meaningful conversation. Ow. Thought I could dodge it there, but I guess not. Flirt one more time before we mercy. Oh no, I didn't mean to flee. Alright, well, whatever, that works too. What switch are we gonna hit here? If you can read this, press the green switch. Which one's green? Not that one. Alright, cool. We have to, <laughs> we gotta start all over in this room. At least we know what we're doing now. Do we have to re-hit the switch? No, we do not. Which means we can just blaze right on through. We're probably gonna hit an enemy in this room. Alright, hit the switch. There we go. Press that ish. Let's keep going. I'm surprised we made it into this room without a battle, but I'll take it. Okay, so there's a doorway up there, and one over there. Alright, let's go up first. What do we have up here? A tree? Oh dear, that took longer than I thought it would. What's up, Toriel? Are you calling me even though I'm right in front of you? How did you get here, my child? Are you hurt? There, there. I will heal you. I should not have left you alone for so long. It was irresponsible to try to surprise you like this. Er, well, I suppose I cannot hide it any longer. Come, small one. What if I don't want to, huh? There's another path over here I want to explore first, Toriel. Hello. Ribbit, ribbit. Just between you and me? I saw Toriel come out of here just a little while ago. She was carrying some groceries. I didn't ask what they were for. We're all too intimidated to talk to her. Now why is that? Whoa, hey, why is there a knife here? You found the toy knife! Oh, did I just take the knife? <laughs> that's great. Alright, well, now we have something to protect ourselves with in this pacifist playthrough where we won't be hurting literally anyone. That's cool. Every time this old tree grows and any leaves, they fall right off. That's a shame. Hey, save point. Save. Nope, why did you not save? Hey, thank you. Anything hidden back here? Nope. Anything hidden over here? Nope. I wonder if we can read that sign above the door. I guess not. Alright. Do you smell that? Surprise! It's a butterscotch cinnamon pie! I thought we might celebrate your arrival. I want you to have a nice time living here. So I will hold off this on snail pie for tonight. Here, I have another surprise for you. Oh, uh, where are you going? I was not pushing her that way, but okay. These books are worn. They must have been read many times. Quaint little house you got here. Inside is an old candle. Uh, an old calendar from the beginning of 20... 20 uh, what? 2000... something... 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, to 19? I don't know. What year could it be? It's already passed in our time. It's 2020 now. It's a history book. Here's a random page. Trapped behind the barrier and fearful of further human attacks, we retreated. Far, far into the earth we walked, until we reached the cavern's end. This was our new home, 
which we named home. How so creative. <laughs> as great as our king is, he's pretty lousy at names. Well, yeah, that's for sure. The ends of the tools have been filed down to make them safer. The fire isn't burning hot, just pleasantly warm. You can put your hand inside. Seems like the right size for Toriel. Who would have thought? What's up here? The kitchen. There's some white fur stuck in the drain. Uh, that's concerning. Inside the cupboard are cookie cutters for gingerbread monsters. What a nice smell. Too hot to eat, though. The stovetop is very clean. Toriel must use fire magic instead. <laughs> What's in the fridge? For some reason, there's a brand new, a, a brand name chocolate bar in the fridge. <laughs> what brand, though? You ain't gonna tell us the brand? I guess sponsorship. Uh, errors with that sponsorship. Can't say it. What in the world is down here? Oh no 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 no! Hey, do not go down here. I have something to show you upstairs. Oh, she's just gonna pull me upstairs. Dang. All right, I guess we're going this way. <laughs> this is it. A room of your own. I hope you like it. Oh, she's petting our head. How motherly. Is something burning? Uh, make yourself at home. Okay, goodbye. I'm just gonna keep snooping through your stuff. You've seen this type of plant before, but do not know its name. It's Flowey. Flowey's just watching us everywhere we go. Inside the drawer are flower seeds and some broken crayons. Room under renovations. What's in this room? Oh, it's a mirror. It's me! It is me! You've seen this type of plant before. Alright, cool. So she recognizes some plants, but not what they actually are. Can we go in here? It's Toriel's diary. Read the circled passage. Hell yeah! You read the passage. Why did the skeleton want a friend? Because she was feeling bonely. <laughs> the rest of the page is filled with jokes of a sim similar caliber. Alright, so she writes some, some crappy jokes. Ah, the cactus. Truly the most sundary of plants. What? You peek inside. Scandalous. It's Toriel's sock drawer. What's so scandalous about a sock drawer? It's an encyclopedia of subterranean plants. You open to the middle. Typha, a group of wetland flowering plants with brown, oblong seed pods. Known more commonly as water sausages. <laughs> Definitely bigger than a twin size bed. Yes, but this is Toriel's room. That makes sense. Can we go through the trash? Ew. Her bucket is full of snails. This is our room now. Look at these cool toys. They don't interest you at all. <laughs> An empty photo frame. It's really dusty. No, nope, I already checked the photo frame. A box of kid shoes in a disparity of sizes. That's concerning. Oh, we can turn the light off. Cool, let's turn the lights off. Can I not explore what's in here? I like how the music changes too. Cool, alright, let's go to sleep. Good night. Good night, Doriel. Aw, she left us a little piece of cake. How cute. You found a slice of butterscotch cinnamon pie. Cool. Is she asleep now? Is she in her room? Nope, no she's not. Alright, Toriel, where are you? You sitting by the fire? Yes, she is. Up already, I see. Um, I want you to know how glad I am to have someone here. There are so many old books- ah, I skipped it. I want to show you my favorite bug hunting spot. I've also prepared a curriculum for your education. This may come as a surprise to you, but I've always wanted to be a teacher. Actually, perhaps this isn't very surprising. Still, I am glad to have you living here. Oh, did you want something? What is it? When can I go home? Yeah, I want to go home. What? This this is your home now. Uh, would you like to hear about this book I am reading? It's called 72 Uses for Snails. Who would have guessed that you would have 72 uses for snails when you've got a trash bin full of them? How to exit? What? Oh, okay, I see. How about it or how to exit the ruins? Um. Okay, I'm not doing that. It's just kind of doing it on its own. The sensitivity is way too high. 
Sure, let's hear about it. Here's an exciting snail fact. Did you know that snails make terrible shoelaces? What? Who, who's trying to use snails as, as shoelaces? What? Um, that just raises so many more questions. Why would anyone try and use snails as shoelaces? One, they're not flat. Two, they're slimy and move around. Three, they're living creatures. What? You're using them to tie your shoes together? That's wrong. Okay, how do we exit the ruins? I have something to do. Stay here. Okay, bye. Way to just dodge my question. That's super cool. Did anything change in the kitchen? Uh, well, the slice of pie is gone. Does it say it's too hot now? The size of the pie intimidates you too much for you to eat it. Oh, what a shame. Is there still white fur? Yes, there is. Where did she go? Can we escape now? The music just so drastically changes. Uh-oh. What you doing, Toriel? I thought she just, like, slides across the screen like that. You wish to know how to return home. Do you not? Ahead of us lies the end of the ruins. A one-way exit to the rest of the underground. I'm going to destroy it. No one will ever be able to leave again. Now, be a good child and go upstairs. No, I can't let you do that, Toriel. Toriel, I need to go home to my family. Every human that falls down here meets the same fate. I've seen it again and again. They come, they leave, they die. You naive child, if you leave the ruins, they, Asgore, will kill you. I'm only protecting you, do you understand? Go to your room. I'm not gonna do it, Toriel. I need to leave. Do not try and stop me. This is your final warning. We're going for it. We want to leave so badly? <sighs> you are just like the others. There's only one solution to this. Prove yourself. Prove to me you are strong enough to survive. Let's do this, Toriel. I'm not gonna fight you. You are a loving mother to me, and you're gonna let me pass. Let's talk to her. You couldn't think of any conversation topics real smooth. Oh, whoa! Alright. That, like, kind of floats up. It does, like, a little parabola. Toriel is acting aloof. Let's talk again. Okay. We can't think of anything to say. Real smooth. Jesus, what in the heck? Toriel prepares a magical attack. Please, Toriel, talk to me. Ironically, talking does not seem to be the solution to this situation. Oh boy, oh boy, oh! Stay alive! Let's go. What if we, what if we spare her? Ah, I was not watching. Turn on the horror, lower the volume a little bit for you guys. It seems a little loud. Let me flee! Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh no, I got hit! Shoot, I got hit twice! Oh, that's not good. Uh, spider donut. Sweet. I don't like this attack, Toriel. This is not cool. Alright, that was close, that was close. Can we talk, please? Toriel, why don't you like talking with me? Hey, that was the- Oh no! I was gonna say, that was the first time I avoided that attack, but I did not avoid it. Okay, talking, talking's not working. There's gotta be another way to do this. Shoot, oh, what the heck? How are we supposed to dodge that attack? Spare me! Come on, Torhill! What the heck are these attacks even? I'm never gonna win this game, guys. This is so hard. Uh, how much is the pie? Alright, full health. Cool. Glad we just wasted all our items. Toriel, can you just please talk to me? I'm trying so hard here. There's a map. Okay, how do I- can I flee? Escape. Wait. That is right, go upstairs. Okay, that's not what I wanted. I should not have fleed. I should just keep- keep trying to spare her, I guess. Yeah, I think- oh, what? Two attacks? Are you kidding me? How did I dodge that, but I couldn't dodge the other ones? Let's- let's spare. We're just gonna keep sparing. That's gonna be the, the only thing we do. We're not gonna hurt our, our foe mother. Come on, Toriel, you can do it. Let me go. You're gonna kill me. I'm gonna die. That was a really, really bad attack. 
Oh, 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 she's avoiding us. Look at that, the attacks are very... They, they, they look like they were specifically avoiding us. She won't let us die. Yeah, see? She's not gonna let us die. Awesome. Spare me, Toriel. What are you proving this way? I'm proving that I can be a pacifist and make it through these ruins. She just, she just won't do it. Alright, maybe I should try talking to her. God dang it, Daisy, why can't you think of anything to say? Toriel, come on! End this fight already! You know you don't want to hurt me anymore. Stop looking at me. I'm gonna give you those puppy dog eyes until you stop attacking me. Is there something else I'm supposed to be doing? Because I won't fight her. I'm not sure if there's something else I'm supposed to be doing. Who knows? Toriel looks through you. Come on, Toriel. Oh, oh, I know you want to go home, but... Spare. But please, go upstairs now. I won't do it. I promise I will take good care of you here. I know we do not have much, but... We can have a good life here. Why are you making this so difficult? Please, go upstairs. Alright, come on. Pathetic, is it not? I cannot save even a single child. No, I understand. You would just be unhappy trapped down here. The ruins are very small once you get used to them. It would not be right for you to grow up in a place like this. My expectations, my loneliness, my fear. For you, my child, I will put them aside. If you truly wish to leave the ruins, I will not stop you. However, when you leave, please do not come back. I hope you understand. I'm glad Toriel finally came around to the idea of us leaving. Can I have another piece of pie for the road? I can't move. Oh, she was just kind of staring at us. Okay, that's cool. Let's do it! Out into the ruins! I'm ready. I'm ready for this adventure, this exploration. I'm ready for a save point. <laughs> are we going to meet up with Flowey again before we leave? I feel like we are. So what's up with this color changing path? Here we go. It is Flowey. I knew we were going to meet up with Flowey. Clever. Very clever. You think you're really smart, don't you? In this world, it's kill or be killed. So you were able to play by your own rules. You spared the life of a single person. I bet you feel really great. You didn't kill anybody this time. But what will you do if you meet a relentless killer? You'll die, and you'll die, and you'll die. Until you tire of trying. What will you do then? Will you kill out of frustration? Or will you give up entirely on this world? And let me inherit the power to control it. I am the prince of this world's future. Don't worry, my little monarch. My plan isn't regicide. This is so much more interesting. What the heck? That is so creepy. Flowey, can you go away and let me go on my adventure? Thank you. Goodbye. Is there anything else in this room? Probably not. No. All right. Dope. Bye, Flowey. Out into the ruins we go. Undertale. Dun, dun, dun. I'm going to take this opportunity to clean my glasses real quick. By Toby Fox. Yo, Toby Fox is a musical genius. The music in this game is so great. Ah. There we go. Hey, we are out in the normal ruins now. We're about to meet Sans, aren't we? I think we are. And, uh, what's his name? The brother's name. Why don't I remember? I know there's, like, the, that huge theory from Game Theory that they're both part of W.D. Gaster. I believe that's the theory. They're, like, part of his, his essence or something. I'm not really sure. And I know it's, like, very, very rare if you even see W.D. Gaster pop up in a single playthrough. 
It's like totally random. Oh, the tree in the foreground looks cool. Oh, that's creepy. Good thing this is a Spooktober game. Two trees. Oh boy. <gasps> what was that? I saw someone. Someone's following us. No, oh, where is he? You know he's there somewhere. Oh god. I can't move. There he is. The hooded figure. Who could it be? Human. Don't you know how to greet a new pal? Turn around and shake my hand. <laughs> Yo, it's Sans, let's go. The old whoopee cushion in the hand trick. It's always funny. Anyways, you're a human, right? That's hilarious. I'm Sans, Sans the Skeleton. I'm actually supposed to be on watch for humans right now. But, you know, I don't really care about capturing anybody. Now, my brother Papyrus, he's a human hunting fanatic. Hey, actually, I think that's him over there. I have an idea. Go through this gate thingy. Yeah, go right through. My bro made the bars to too wide to stop anyone. Quick, behind that conveniently shaped lamp. How perfect that we can fit right behind it. Sup, bro? You know what? Sup, brother? It's been eight days and you still haven't re recalibrated your puzzles. You just hang around outside your station. What are you even doing? Staring at this lamp. It's really cool. Do you want to look? No, I don't have time for that. What if a human comes through here? I want to be ready. I will be the one. I must be the one. I will capture a human. Then I, the Great Papyrus, will get all the things I utterly deserve. Respect, recognition. I will finally be able to join the Royal Guard. People will ask to be my friend. I will bathe in a shower of kisses every morning. Hmm. Maybe this lamp will help you. Sans, you are not helping you, lazy bones. All you do is sit around boondog and boondoggle. And uh, you get lazier and lazier every day. Hey, take it easy. I've gotten a ton of work done today. A skeleton. <laughs> Oh my god, the fourth wall breaks. Sons! Come on, you're smiling. I am, and I hate it. Ugh. Why does someone as great as me have to do so much to get... just to get some recognition? Wow, sounds like you're really working yourself. Down to the bone. <laughs> they just keep coming out. Sons can't help but spew those puns. I will attend to my puzzles. As for your work, put a little more backbone into it. <laughs> can I come out of hiding now? He came back just to laugh once more. Okay, you can come out now. You ought to get going. He might come back. And if he does, you'll have to sit through more of my hilarious jokes. Nice. Isn't there supposed to be a vendor here? Yeah, there's no one. No one there. Let's keep going forward. Actually, hey, hate to bother you, but can you do me a favor? I was thinking, my brother's been kind of down lately. He's never seen a human before, and seeing you might just make his day. Don't worry, he's not dangerous. Even if he tries to be. Thanks a million, I'll be up ahead. Walks backwards. Hey, save point. The conven convenience of that lamp still fills you with determination. Really? It would fill me with fear. What do we got here? This is a box. You can put an item inside or take an item out. The same box will appear later, so don't worry about coming back. Oh, so cool, it's like an ender chest. Use the box? Sure, let's put the toy knife in the box. And there's a tough glove. Can we wear the tough glove? Uh, item, tough glove, use. You equip tough glove. Cool. Oh, all right, we're in a battle. I guess the tough club doesn't really do anything for us, though, since we're not attacking. Snowdrake flutters forth. 
What's up, Snow Drake? We're gonna joke with you. You make a bad ice pun. I've heard that one. Well, why can't you get a sense of humor, even if you have heard it? You can still laugh at my joke. It's the polite thing to do. Let's do another joke. Make another bad ice pun. Is that supposed to be funny? No, thank you. Do not touch me. Alright, let's laugh at him. Before it says anything funny. What are you laughing at? Wouldn't you like to know, fed boy? Let's heckle him. You boo the snow drake. Insults towards humans. <laughs> what? You can't even think of a good insult, that's all you can say? Realized its own name is a pun and is freaking out. <laughs> spare him. Oh no, he won't let us spare him. Whoa, 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 whoa. It was close. It smells like a wet pillow. Ew. Let's joke. Another bad ice pun. Hey, he laughed. He laughed at that one. I'll take it. That's a laugh. Okay. Can we spare you now? Nope. Cool. Real, real cool, dude. How about now? Fights you in something? I did not read that. Whoopsie. My fault. Ice to meet you. Now he's doing all the puns? Alright, maybe we need to make him laugh again. You make another bad ice pun. And he's heard that one. Cool. Okay, I don't really know what the pattern is for this enemy. We gotta learn. Laugh at him again. See? Dad was wrong. What What was Dad wrong about? That you were funny? Let's keep laughing at him. I think he likes that. You have good taste. Alright, so he likes when we laugh at his bad jokes. So that might be the way to destroy this guy. Let's do it. Yeah, there we go. Alright, so we just gotta laugh at him. Yo, what's up, Terror? Sans is here. We finally found Sans. This is my first playthrough, by the way. I have no idea what I'm doing. It's a fishing rod affixed to the ground. Reel it in? Yeah, let's reel it in. What do we got? All that's attached to the end is a photo of a weird-looking monster. Call me. Here's my number. You decide not to call. Wait, what if I want to take it? Send the line back out. All right, can we keep reeling it in? Let's see what else we can fish. Nope, it's just, it's just the photo. Okay, guess not. Let's keep going. Oh, there's Sans and Ness. Sans and Ness. I'm talking... God dang it. Forget what I just said. I was thinking of that stupid game theory he did. No, I'm sorry. I don't know where my head's at. That's Sans Papyrus. Oh, they're both looking at me. They're just gonna keep speeding up. <laughs> oh my god. Sans, oh my god, is that a human? Oh boy, hide behind the rock. Uh, actually, I think that's a rock. Uh, hey, what's that in front of the rock? Oh my god, is, is that a human? Yes. Oh my god, Sans, I finally did it. Undyne will, I'm gonna, I'll be so popular. Ahem. Human, you shall not pass this area. I, the Great Papyrus, will stop you. I will then capture you. You will be delivered to the capital. Then, then... I'm not sure what's next. In any case, continue only if you dare. <laughs> well, that went well. Don't sweat it, kid. I'll keep an eye socket out for you. <laughs> As he winks his eye socket. Yo, Terra, how you doing? Welcome welcome to the stream. There's some narration on this cardboard box. You observe the well-crafted sentry station. Who could have built this, you ponder? I bet it was that very famous royal guardsman. No, not yet a very famous royal guardsman. So that's Papyrus's. Cool. Glad we got that backstory. Ice Cap struts into view. Let's compliment him. You inform the Ice Cap that it has a great hat. Duh, who doesn't know? Oh god, oh god. Okay, okay. I see what's going on here. Cool, cool. I like that attack. Let's compliment him again. My hat's too loud for me to hear you. What? How is a hat too loud? Also wants a hat for its nose. Envious? Too bad. What is that? 
Okay. Oh, they fall too. Cool. Let's compliment once more. Okay. Guess he's not really digging the compliments. Let's try something else. Let's ignore him. You managed to tear your eyes away from Ice Cap's hat. It looks annoyed. Hello, my hat's up here! So he wants us to look at the hat, but doesn't care if we compliment it. We steal? He tried to steal the Ice Cap's hat, but it's not weakened enough. Help! Fashion police! <laughs> That's great. Oh shoot. Compliment the hat again. Okay. I don't get it, dude. You don't like when I compliment the hat. You don't like when I try and steal it. What do you want from me? My head looks so naked, that's because I don't have a hat on. Maybe if you give me your hat, I can wear it. Let's ignore him. Feels defeated. Okay, I'll ignore you too. As he starts to attack me. Ooh, that was close. Is desperate for attention. No, you don't get attention. Alright, so we gotta ignore the ice cap. Got it. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Better a hatter than a hater. Okay, I think we can spare him now. Yeah, there we go. All right, so he just needs to be ignored. See, we're learning. As we go, we learn each enemy's moveset and their tactics and how to passively kill them. Absolutely no moving. Yeah, all right, okay. Doggo? It's a doggo. Oh my God. There's a doggo. Did something move? Was it my imagination? I can only see moving things. If something was moving, for example, a human, I'll make sure it never moves again. Oh boy. Doggo blocks the way. What's up, Doggo? We're gonna pet the Doggo. Doggo is too suspicious of your movements. Don't move an inch. Okay, I won't. Oh god, nope, nope. Okay, oh, oh gotcha, gotcha, gotcha. Okay, so blue, blue things, you don't move. Right. Blue things don't move. Got it. I should have listened to directions. That was my fault. It moved. It didn't not move. Okay, don't move on blue. Good, good, good. Doggo can't seem to find anything. That's because we're not moving. His sight really does work on vision. Aw, he likes our pet. What? I've been pet! Pat, pot, pet, pot? Let's, let's pet him again. I want to keep petting the doggo. Where's that coming from? We just, we just get to stay still. This is such an easy fight. Uh, can we can we mercy? Yes, we can. Awesome. Hey, we got thirty gold from that. Oh, that's great. S something pet me. Something that isn't m moving. I'm gonna need some dog treats for this. Okay, bye. Wait, can I buy from you? Oh, I can. Hello, is anybody there? No. All right, wait. What if we give him a dog treat? Somebody's been smoking dog treats. Oh my god. Okay, so I cannot pick it up, which means we can't talk to you, which means we're gonna move on. Alrighty. Hey, what's up, Sans? Hey, here's something important to remember. My brother has a very special attack. If you see a blue attack, don't move and it won't hurt you. Here's an easy way to keep it in mind. Imagine a stop sign. When you see a stop sign, you stop, right? Stop signs are red, so I imagine a blue stop sign instead. Simple, right? When fighting, think about blue stop signs. So helpful. Thank you. Thank you, Sans. North Ice, South Ice, West, West Ice, East Snowden Town, and Ice. So there's ice everywhere we go. Let's go up. It's a snowman! Hello, I am a snowman. I want to see the world, but I cannot move. If you would be so kind, Traveler, please... Take a piece of meat and bring it very far away. All right, sure. Good luck. You got the snowman piece. What piece of the snowman do we have in particular? Heals 45 HP. Whoa, please take this to the ends of the earth. That's crazy. That's a lot of HP. I feel like we should try and save that, though, and just bring that to the end of the game. You're so lazy. You were napping all night. I think that's called sleeping. Excuses, excuses. Oh ho, the human arrives. In order to stop you, my brother and I have created some puzzles. I think you will find this one quite shocking. For you see, this is the invisible electricity maze. When you touch the walls of this maze, this orb will administer a hearty zap. Sounds like fun. 
because the amount of fun you pro will probably have is actually rather small, I think. Okay, you can go ahead now. Uh, he just shocked himself. Sans, what did you do? I think the human has to hold the orb. Oh, okay. He <laughs> just... Oh, I thought he was gonna walk around the whole maze. Okay, well, thanks for laying out the path for me. Hold this, please. It just lands on my head. <laughs> okay, try now. Oh, I can't... Dang it, I can't walk around the maze. Okay, thanks for lining out the path for me. Incredible, you slippery snail. You solved it so easily. Too easily. However, next puzzle will not be so easy. It is assigned by my brother, Sans. So you will surely... I'm skipping through the text too fast. Okay, let's go to the next puzzle. What's up, Sans? Hey, thanks. My brother seems like he's having fun. By the way, did you see that weird outfit he's wearing? We made that a few weeks ago for a costume party. He hasn't worn anything else since. He keeps calling it his battle body. Man, isn't my brother cool? Yo, who are you? I don't understand why these aren't selling. It's the perfect weather for something cold. Ah, uh, you might want to rethink your business strategy there, bud. Oh, a customer! We have 83 gold now, nice. Hello, would you like some nice cream? It's the frozen treat that warms your heart. Now just 15 gold, sure, why not? Here you go, have a super duper day. And we got the nice cream, awesome. Let's keep going. Why is there a snowball here? Uh, push the snowball this way. Keep going. All the way down, go on. Through the maze. No, 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 come back. Where am I trying to get this to? Oh, I guess in here? I guess I'm just trying to get in that hole. Alright, what do I get from this? Oh, that was close, that was close. Here we go. Hey, hole in one. Kind of. There's another snowball here. Can we can we knock this in as well? It looks like a snowball. Actually, it's a snow decahedron. <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Wait, what do we get for making this goal though? Do I get anything for that? I guess not. Oh, there's another one. Wait, wait, what if we get this one in the goal now? Can we just do this over and over again? Can we play golf for the rest of the stream, guys? No, 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 no. Go down. I gotta get you in the hole. Shoot. Go. No. What are you doing, you stupid snowball? This reminds me of Club Penguin, just knocking the hockey puck around. Whoa, whoa, okay. Very hard to aim on the ice. Hey, that was a good hit. Oh no, oh no, it's actually shrinking. Okay, that's it. And then I guess it just respawns every time. I didn't realize the snowball shrank though as it went. That's cool. I've been thinking about selling treats too. Want some fried snow? It's just five gold. Uh, I'll pass on the fried snow because I'm pretty sure that's just water. Alright, what is going on with my analog stick? You're right. I should charge way more than that. Yo, what's up, Mastro? Welcome. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the dojo. We are playing Undertale today. This is my first playthrough ever. What is this, his and hers, it says? Cute. What is this? Smell danger rating? Snow smell. Snowman white rating can become yellow rating. I think this is two dog stalls, and they're talking about peeing on snow, which is great. That, that That's just great. All right, so this is not where we're supposed to be going. Uh, hello. Walk around the snow decahedron, please. Human, I hope you're ready for... For what? Sans, where's the puzzle? It's right there, on the ground. Trust me, there's no way they can make it past this one. Uh, what's your puzzle? Monster Kids Word Search. Oh, boy. Hey, kids, can you help me solve this puzzle? Wait, wait, how do I... How do I solve it? Um... I don't... It won't let me... Do I click? No? I'm using a, a controller, so I don't know what it's looking for me to do. Uh, okay. Let's just talk to them. Son, that didn't do anything! Whoops, I knew I should have used today's crossword instead. What? Crossword? I can't believe you said that. In my opinion, Junior Jumble is, easy, is easily the hardest. What? Really? Really, dude? That's easy peasy word scramble? That's for baby bones. Unbelievable. 
human, solve this dispute. Which is harder, jumble or crossword? Uh, sorry bud, crossword's harder. You two are weird. Crosswords are so easy. It's the same solution every time. I just fill all the boxes in with the letter Z. Because every time I look at a crossword, all I can do is snore. Yes, that is the perfect solution to a crossword. Hey, we get to save. Yeah, let's see. What do we got here? It's a note from Papyrus. Human, please enjoy this spaghetti. Little do you know, this spaghetti is a trap designed to entice you. You'll be so busy eating it that you won't realize that you aren't progressing. Thoroughly japed? What in the world is that word? Again, by the great Papyrus. All right, let's, let's eat some spaghetti. It's a plate of frozen spaghetti. It's so cold, it's stuck to the table. What, the plate is stuck to the table too? It's an unplugged microwave. Thanks. Thanks so much, Papyrus. The unplugged... Unplugged microwave is so so helpful. All right, let's uh let's keep going. We're gonna keep progressing. I saw that and I'm so happy that someone is doing this game on Twitch. I always think that this game is dead, and I like seeing someone playing it without spoiler because it's funny to see someone failing. My apologies for my English, but I'm Italian. Yo, your English is perfectly fine. And if you have any issues with language, don't worry about it. I'll uh, I'll piece together the message as best I can. But your English seems pretty good to me. Uh, but yeah, this is the I just built a PC for the first time this summer. So I'm going through like a, a whole bunch of Steam games that I never had access to on my Mac because basically almost no Steam games are made for a Mac to be able to run it. But uh, this was one of them. I bought it back in the, during the summer, but I was waiting specifically for October to play it because I know it's one of those like kind of spooky games. So uh, yeah, here we are. We're, we're going through it. I'll probably play for like another 30 minutes and then uh, I'll switch over to Fall Guys to end my stream. A lesser dog appears. Oh, by the way, uh, if you didn't know, we're going for the Pacifist playthrough. Oh my god, there's so many pet options. Let's do them all. You barely lifted your hand unless a dog got excited. <laughs> pant, pant. He wants the love. He wants my love. Oh my god, don't hurt me. Lesser dog is barking excitedly. Let's do pet number two. You lightly touch the dog. It's already overexcited. Is his neck getting bigger every time he gets excited? Oh god, don't move. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Go away. Okay, we're getting, we're getting someone better at this. I gotta learn... I gotta remember for the blues not to move. All right, pet number three. Yo, his head is definitely getting bigger. It raises its head up to meet your hand. What you got now? What attack? Yeah, 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 okay, jump. Oh no, he hit me. Pet number four. Oh yes, this dog. Oh my God, I can't. The head keeps getting bigger and creepier. Why is the head getting so big? This should not be allowed. No, oh crap, I should've gone to the right. Is overstimulated. Pet number four. We'll do pet number five next time. Is his head just gonna go off the screen at this point? Oh, dang it, I thought I could dodge him there. All right, here we go, pet number five. Critical pet, dog excitement increased. Excitement, dog noises. Lesser dog is overstimulated, let's go. We beat him and we earned seven gold. What, what do we got here? Can we uncover this? And X marks the spot, <gasps> where's this? Wait, where is this though? This is a map. This is your first run, right? Yes, this is my first run. Uh, a long, long time ago, I did watch Markiplier play this on YouTube, but um, I've never played the game myself. I've never extensively watched playthroughs. Like I only did one watch through of Marks, I think. Where is this? I wanna know where this place is. Or is, is this it? Is it talking about this place I'm currently in? Cause it might, which would mean that right over here is X marks the spot. Ice Cap and Snow Drake confront you, sighing. All right, so the Ice Cap we just have to ignore. We know that now. I don't know what this thing in the middle is. Never seen him. Uh, but it's going to be very difficult to dodge all three of these attacks at the same time. So this is not ideal. At least it's a little more spaced out, it seems. Okay, let's uh, continue to ignore Ice Cap. Also, if you have any tips uh, for defeating certain bad guys, Feel free to shout it out. If there's like cool collectibles I'm missing or just, just cool parts of the game that I, I might walk past and miss, feel free to tell me because I'd rather uh, miss it and be told so I can go back and find it than not see it at all. Uh, what does that say? Snowdrake realized its own name is a pun. Yep, uh, you you have that existential crisis. You continue not looking at Ice Cap's hat. It seems defeated. Perfect, okay. So now we can uh, spare him. We should be good. 
Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. We're gonna get hit. Yep, there, there's too many things going on. Okay, let's uh, spare. Perfect, one of them's gone. Hey, look at that heart. Did you? Wait, you followed. How did you get that emote? Did you subscribe? You, sorry, I missed the follow notification, but thank you for the follow. Emote is so cool. Thanks, I, I love these emotes. I literally just got them done by this awesome artist. Check out, this is these are my dog emotes. That's what my, my doggo looks like. You love it. <laughs> yeah, wait, but did, did you subscribe? Because I never got a notification. Also, wait, you know, that, that's a tier one subscription one. Yeah, I moved that to a tier one. That's odd. Let's go, Snow Drake, and we're gonna laugh. He likes when we laugh. Thanks, you're all great. Oh, shoot. I just died. <laughs> oh, no, dang it. Yeah, but wait, uh, did you use your Prime Sub? I'm, I'm genuinely confused. Use oh, you unlocked it with points. Right, I forgot that was a thing. Okay, well, that's cool. <laughs> I'm glad you, you were able to use your Dojo coins for something. All right, respawn time. Let's get back into this battle. All right, we're just here. I don't think we've missed much. Right, and there's an X marks the spot right over here. But what do I do? Lesser dog is back. Time to pet the lesser dog. Can I just keep petting him until his head is off the screen? Because I kind of want to do that. Dang it, how do I avoid this jumping dog? Pet, pet, pet. Keep using the pets. Well, regardless of uh, the subscription, thank you for the follow. The follow always helps. Now I'm only five followers away from 100. You should tell your friends. Oh, shoot! Mastro with the tier one sub! Why, did, why were there no sound effects? What? I did not hear sound effects. That's a shame. Well, thank you for the sub. Welcome to the Dojo Squad, my friend. If you would like to join our Discord community, you can use the exclamation point, exclamation point, I can speak. Discord command. Just use exclamation point Discord. But thank you so much for the tier one sub. You are my first subscription of Spooktober. I'm gonna keep petting this dog until its head goes off the screen. Yes, now you can use all the cute doggo emotes. Oh shoot, what the heck? Came out of the right side of the screen. Whoa, 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 no, no, not, not items. We're gonna pet this doggo. Keep petting him. I love when people spam my emotes, so never be afraid to just continually spam them. I give you full permission. Oh shoot, I took two hits of damage there, that was so dumb. Oh no, oh no, oh no, oh no. Oh, that was so close. Did you see how close that, that was to me? I'm gonna join the Discord right now? Awesome! Our Discord community is still, still growing, slowly but surely, but uh, we'll, we'd love to have you there. I'm gonna keep petting him. You have to jump up to pet the dog because his head's so high. Yo, yes, we can just keep petting now. And we don't even get attacked. I think I just got a notification that you joined the uh, the server. Okay, its ears are off the screen. We can almost get its tongue off the screen. And then we won't be able to tell if it's growing anymore. Lesser dog enters the realm of the clouds. Oh my god. You call the dog, but it is too late. It cannot hear you. Far away bark. <laughs> oh my god, its head is curling back down. Oh my god. It shows no signs of stopping. Joined, heck yeah! Thank you for joining the Discord. You can reach Lesser Dog again. His head's coming back down. Will his head just like wrap around the screen like a snake game? But if so, I'm gonna keep petting him. This is just this is gonna be the rest of the stream, guys. We're just we're petting dogs the whole stream. That's all it's about. That's all we came here to do was pet dogs. Who wants Undertale? All we need is Dog, Petter, dog Pet Simulator 3000. Can I really, I'm gonna make a game like that. I'm gonna make a game and I'm gonna get it onto Steam and it's literally just gonna be called Dog Pet Simulator. And all you do is pet different dogs. Oh my God, how far is this dog's head gonna go? I can't, it's so big. Oh no. I did the wrong thing. Its head didn't grow. <laughs> it's possible that you may have a problem. Thanks, game, but I like petting dogs. Also, I love how his face, not his body, but literally just his face, his eyes, nose, and mouth, clip over the text. Oh, 
I just want to know where his head's gonna go when it reaches the bottom now. Like, does it keep wrapping around? Is there a point where the dog's head can no longer grow? Is there an achievement for getting to that point? Who knows? I do have a problem. It's called I love dogs too much. Oh my god, I played Undertale, but I never did this. I just want to- I want to push it to its limits, you know? Where does it break? Where does it say too much? His head is almost by his feet. Oh no, I did the wrong move again. <laughs> I wish you could see like a hand animation actually petting the dog's head. That'd be cute. That'd be real cute. He's almost there. He's almost at the bottom of the screen. Yes, keep going down, doggo. What if he... What if his head pops into the box where my heart's at? Oh no, it's behind it. Dang it. Alright, once his mouth is gone, we'll finish this. Because I doubt... His head will probably end up coming back up the other side. Lesser dog is unpettable, but appreciates the attempt. <laughs> okay, I think that's all we're gonna get is the unpettable now. We'll try once more. Yeah, okay, that's the end. Goodbye. Look at how fast his tail is wagging. Back to normal head doggo. Hey, we got 20 gold. This is supposed to be X, X marks the spot. There's a switch hidden in the snow. There we go. What did that do? I clicked it. The switch is stuck now. Wait, but I, I clicked the switch. What did that get me? Oh boy. I see X marks the spot. What was I supposed to do with that? What in the world is this? Uh oh. More doggos. What's that smell? Where's well, that smell? If you're a smell, identify your smell. Oh my god. Oh my god. Just don't move and they won't see you. <laughs> hmm. Here's that weird smell. It makes me want to eliminate. Eliminate you. Oh no. Doggy. A doggy assault. Dog Amy and Dog Arissa? Uh, let's pet them. The dogs are too suspicious of your smell. Claws off, you smelly human! GG, now it's a little, uh, complicate to... Oh shoot, I gotta not move with the blue. Stay still, stay still. The dogs are practicing for the next couples contest. Yeah, we're gonna die, we need help. Uh, what is this stick gonna do? That is... nope. Oh, they played fetch with it. Cool. Take my wife's, please. Oh no, what in the world is this? Shoot. It's a little complicated to square them. To spare them, sorry. To spare them. I'm not giving up, I just keep dying game. We got this. I think, oh no. This spawns us before that dog fight. I just wanted that switch. I don't know what the switch did. So wait, hang on. I wanna see. What's up, Lesser? No, 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 don't fight him. Jump over me. Jump over- Aww. He didn't jump. Okay. Let's not do that. Can I- Can I act? Yo, I literally- There we go. It wouldn't let me click act. Okay. Let's get him excited. We'll breeze through this fight. We won't- We won't stay around petting him the whole time. Just until it's enough to spare him. Dang it, dang it. That attack is so hard to hit. For it to not get hit by. Oh! It was close. It was very close. I will tell you only this. First act with the female dog and after with the male. Ooh, alright, alright. Okay, can we spare you? Perfect. Now, what happens if we hit that switch? Was this area blocked off? Oh, alright. So the switch activates or deactivates those spikes. That's all. I see. Let's press that switch. Good. Here we go. Back to this dog fight. Go through. Come on. Here we go. We'll skip on through their text real quick. Oh, I can't even move if I wanted to right now. Alright. Female dog first. I guess the female dog is the one on the right. But which... Which one? I'm guessing the second one? I'm gonna guess it's the second one. Let's pet. Yeah, I know you're too suspicious. They're not gonna let me pet you. 
Stop. Don't touch her. Okay, I think if we just chill right here, we should be good or not. How in the world am I literally supposed to avoid that? That's crazy. Re-sniff? No, let's 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 roll around. You roll around in the dirt and snow. You smell like a weird puppy. Of course we were. Number two puzzle champs. God. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Oh god! Dang it. Oh, I'm dead. <laughs> Dog Arissa? I'm not very good at this fight, it seems. Let's try again. Is this game gonna remember how many times I've died? Because that makes me unhappy. Sweet, sweet, we got the switch. And now we're in this fight. Can we just, like, flee? Hey, we can flee. Cool. We don't gotta deal with you. Okay, let's try this again. Here we go. We should have full health this time since I didn't even bother with fighting that other dog. Let's do it. Eliminate me, I dare you. So why didn't it start? Okay, here we go. Act. Dorissa, let's roll around. Because maybe you like when I smell like a little puppy. Okay, okay. Oh, let's go. Alright, I figured out how to dodge it. Awesome, awesome. The dogs may want to re-smell you. Let's re-smell them. The dogs sniff you again. After rolling in the dirt, you seem... You smell alright. Hey, let's go. You are... Are you actually a little puppy? You're still gonna attack me even though you think I'm a puppy? What kind of parenting is this? Okay, that attack is not bad. Let's do it again. Let's pet. You pet the dog, Arissa. A dog that pets dogs? Amazing! Oh no. I don't like this attack. Ooh, that was close. That was very, very close. Um, maybe we can... Mercy? Nope. That did not work. That was close. Good. Nice. Okay, try again. Pet the dog, Arissa. They like when I pet them. At least it seems that way. Oh, now pet the other one. Oh, okay, okay. I figured I had to get rid of one of them first. Wow, pet by another pup. Well, don't leave me out. Cool, cool. Easy dodge. The dog's minds have been expanded. Perfect. There we go. Yo, thank you for the, the tips, Mastro. Appreciate it. 40 gold. Whoa, that was a lot of gold. Dogs can pet other dogs? A new world has opened up for us. Thanks, weird puppy. Dogs are so lovable and dumb. What is this? Whoa, what? Wait, now it won't change my triangle. Perfect, thank you. Turn every X into an O, then press the switch. All right, well maybe if we press the switch, it'll start over. But uh, how are we supposed to do this? Oh no, 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 don't, don't do that. Cause now you're just a triangle. And I can't switch you. You're all just gonna be triangle. What? How is this done? Ah, maybe like that. Okay, just don't walk to the other side. Duh. Yay, I did it! Yo, I love this emote you're using. Where do you get this emote from? The Pride Pog. Limited time only emote? What? We gotta use it then. Oh no, it did not work for me. I cannot use the emote. Whoops. <laughs> Rip me. What? How did you avoid my trap? And more importantly, is there any left for me? What do you tell what do you tell Papyrus about his spaghetti? Uh um let's lie and make him feel good. I ate it. Really? Wowie! No one's ever enjoyed my cooking before. Well then, fret not, human. I, Master Chef Papyrus, will make you all the pasta you could ever want. It's a limited time emote. Yeah, I figured uh, I would just be able to use it until it runs out. I guess it's a limited time for whoever got it. I, I'm not sure. I don't know. My brother started a sock collection recently. How saddening. Sometimes I wonder what he would do without such a cool guy taking care of him. 
All right, what is your next puzzle, Papyrus? Human, hmm, how do I say this? You were taking a long time to arrive, so I decided to improve this puzzle by arranging the snow to look more like my face. Unfortunately, the snow froze to the ground. Now the solution is different, and as usual, my lazy brother is nowhere around. I suppose what I am saying is, worry not, human. I, the great Papyrus, will solve this conundrum. Then we can both proceed. Meanwhile, feel free to try the puzzle yourself. I'll try not to give away the answer. Okay, so I guess this switch just resets it, yeah. Like these. Whoa, what? Those emotes literally look so cool, I love it. They're so bright and colorful. I like them, I like them. Okay, let's see if we can do this. Oh no, once you step on it twice, it's automatically a triangle. Okay, so that doesn't work. Um, how do we get... So, hmm, we can walk out that way, but how would we get... This is a toughie. Okay, okay. I think I know what to do. We're gonna try this. Yeah, okay, we're good, we're good. Here we go. Got it. Ooh, yeah. We gotta go all the way back around. Here we go. At least we can go around and hit the button. Perfect! Wow! You solved it! And you did it without my help! Incredible! I'm impressed! You must care about puzzles like I do. Well, I'm sure you'll love the next puzzle then. It might even be too easy for you. <laughs> Yo, let's do it. I love these puzzles. Keep hitting me up with these puzzles, Papyrus. Oh, what's up, Sans? Good job on solving it so quickly. You didn't even need my help, which is great, because I love doing absolutely nothing. GG, man. Thank you, thank you. Puzzles are my forte. It's the human. You're gonna love this puzzle. It was made by the great Dr. Alfies. You see these tiles? Once I throw this switch, they will begin to change color. Each color has a different function. Red tiles are impassable. You cannot walk on them. Yellow are electric. They will electrocute you. Green tiles are alarm tiles. If you step on them, you will have to fight a monster. Orange tiles are orange scented. They will make you smell delicious. Blue tiles are water tiles. Swim through them if you like, but if you smell like oranges, the piranhas will bite you. Also, if a blue tile is next to a yellow tile, the water will also zap you. Purple tiles are slippery. You will slide to the next tile. However, the, the slippery soap smells like lemons, which piranhas don't like. Purple and blue are okay. Finally, pink tiles. They don't do anything. Step on them all you like. How is that? Understand? Okay, wow, that was a lot to remember. And this one is very difficult. Watch out. I have a feeling that you're being a little sarcastic there. Yes, I understand the explanation. It's a lot. So let, let's do this. I'm pretty sure it's not going to be random. I think it, it's going to be like a very straightforward puzzle. Because Papyrus just doesn't know what he's doing. When I pull this switch, it will make a puzzle. That's n that has never been seen before. Not even I will know the solution. Oh, 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 what's it gonna be? Oh, 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 it's getting faster. Oh boy. Yep, saw that coming. <laughs> I knew it. <laughs> it's literally just a straight path. Papyrus, what are you doing? Will I actually die? Oh no, I can't even go on there if I wanted. <laughs> I think I kind of knew that this was going to be a joke. Wait, we didn't talk to Sans. Oh, too late. Okay, bye. The machine isn't working. Yeah, no, n not quite. What's up, doggo? This dog is staring blankly into the snow, waiting for it to turn into art. What? You're waiting for the snow to turn into art? Okay, doggo, you have fun with that. Let's save real quick. Fills us with determination. All we need in this game is determination. On the floor inside is a box of Bomba raisins? Is there anything behind the shop? There's a camera behind the sentry station. Wait, what is the camera? On the floor? Wait, what? No. What about the camera? I can't do anything with the camera? Okay, well that sucks. Seems like you could do something with the camera. Who are you? That dog considers itself an artist, but doesn't ever know what to create. Probably doesn't help that its brain is the size of a piece of kibble. 
Oh, another puzzle. Oh, I see, I see, I see. Uh, let's reset. Oh no, I died. Sans. It's a lump of snow with the word Sans written on it. In red marker. What about you? It's a snow papyrus. Okay, cool. I, are those like their graves? Or what? Oh, I missed. Okay, cool. No, shoot. Oh, I see. You can only change direction when you're on those buttons. I gotcha. I gotcha. I see what's going on. Alright, so we need to line up with the button at the very end, which means we need to... Oh, shoot. I didn't mean to go yet. Dang it. Papyrus is actually so cool, dude, but my favorite character is one that you will know in the future. You know, uh, I, you don't have to spoil anything for me. Ugh, dang it. Let's just fall off. Let's start over. Because uh, I, I have technically seen a playthrough, so I do somewhat know what I'm getting into. So who's your favorite character? Is it uh, Undyne, Asgore, Alphys? I know those are some of the main characters. Uh, you figure out what you want to tell me while I do some path planning, because we need to end there. Okay, all right. I got my path figured out. Here we go. And here. Here. Okay, it's easier now that I know she stops on the buttons each time. Perfect. There we go. Easy peasy. Yeah, but pap Papyrus is really cool. I love him as a character. Sans with the fourth wall breaking, though, it's too perfect. What the heck? How did I get a dog on my head? Nope, now it's just a snow pile. I want the doggo back. Give me my snow doggo. Let me walk away with the doggo. Oh, it's a house now? What the heck? What the heck? What's over here? Oh, little dog house. It's a snow puff. And this is a snow puff. And this, however, is a snow puff. Surprisingly, it's a snow puff. Snow puff. Is it really a snow puff? Behold, a snow puff. Eh? There's a. There's 30 gold inside this. What is this? Wait, did I take the gold? I hope I took the gold. <gasps> that is not a snow puff. There's a tail. <gasps> it is a doggo. There's a doggo. Everyone. There's a doggo. There's no need for alarm. Oh my god, that's a big doggo. Never mind. What the heck? Oh my god. It's the greater doggo. Can we can we pet the greater doggo? Greater doggo has a very tiny head compared to its body. Let's pet him. Greater dog is too far away to pet. You just pet the air. Oh no. Oh, he's looking for belly rubs. Oh shoot. Okay, maybe I shouldn't touch him. <laughs> there were so many snow puffs. Let's play with him. Greater Dog is not excited enough to play with. All right. Whoa, 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 buddy. Who said you could bark at me? Um, uh, back in. You call the Greater Dog. That's it. Oh, it bounds towards you, flecking slobber into your face. Ew, gross. Stop attacking me with your borks. Oh my god, listen to the music. Ignore him. Greater Dog inches closer. Oh god, oh god, don't move him. What? What is this trickery? It was blue for a second. Oh god, he's getting closer. No, 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 I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm gonna die, I'm dead. Yeah, no, I, I figured you were talking seriously. God dang it. I cannot believe we died again. Yo, I'm gonna die literally so much in this game. Mastro, do you like watching or playing Fall Guys? Oh shoot, I gotta do this puzzle again. Uh, Alright, let's just fall down. Start that on over real quick. There we go. Good. At least this path is like pretty easy to remember. It's not that hard of a puzzle. Perfect. Go down this time. I didn't go down last time. Yo, what's up, Sans? What's up? That's it. That's all you're gonna say is what's up. Why are there prying eyes in the wall? What the? What the heck, Sans? How are you in two places at once? Gift trot? The gift trot. Okay. Confronts us. What's up, gift trot? Let's 
Uh, let's give him a gift. Gift Drought refuses your gift. How dare you refuse my gift? How do I know it's not a trick? Alright, we gotta gain his trust before we can gift him. Oh my god, he's moved so fast. Distrusts our youthful demeanor. Let's, uh, let's decorate him. You add some googly eyes you found on the ground. <laughs> Gosh darn teenage googly eyes! Ah, don't hit me! No! Maybe I'm strange, but no, I don't like to play Fall Guys, but if someone streams the game, it's okay for me. Well, I hope you'll stick around then, because soon we're gonna switch over to Fall Guys. Uh, I love playing the game, I was literally playing it earlier today, but I have 22 wins in the game now. Stumbles blindly, let's decorate him again. You can't improve on perfection. Oh, alright, guess we can't improve on it. Are you gonna do the, the rain down attack? Oh no, what the? Oh, dang it, I was moving while it came at me. He stumbles blindly. Uh, maybe now we can gift him, because nope. He, even when he can't see, he'll still refuse our gift. Alright, which gift is it gonna be? Left one. Okay, I was not far over enough. That was that was dumb of me. Let's undecorate him. You remove the googly eyes. Thanks for nothing! Ah! Oh no! Ooh, that was close. That was close, that was close. Lament its lack of hands. No, nope, we can't spare him yet. Oh shoot, oh shoot, oh shoot. That was close, that was close. Okay, now can we gift you? Refuses our gift. Listen man, I'm trying to help you out here, but you won't take my gift. Which one's blue? Oh god, okay, good. I was not paying attention. <coughs> ah, the scent of fresh pine needles. What? Which one, which one, which one? Good. Tries vainly to remove its decorations. All right, let's help him. You remove a stocking filled with chicken nuggets! Yum! That's a little better. Alright, so maybe he likes it when he's undecorated, I guess? Oh, shoot. Oh, shoot. Oh, no. I died. <laughs> Rip. Rip Daisy. Oh, yeah, I named my character Daisy. Alright, let's give that another shot. Oh, no! I was not ready for this puzzle again. Can I tell you the truth? I never fight this monster. Why not? You just flee? Shoot. Oh my god. It's dumb ice. I don't know if I'll ever, like, unless a fight is uh, unnecessary and extremely difficult, I probably won't try and flee from a fight if I don't have to. No, shoot. Aw, oh, god dang it. Peaceful music, am I right? Am I right, ladies and gentlemen? Okay. Here we go. We'll go straight to that fight. Or not. We can really just go talk to Sans. <laughs> That's why I was down there. Yo, what's up? You got anything to say over here? Say, are you following me? You don't want to follow me, dude. Alright, uh, here we go. We got him again. Let's, uh, not fight him, please. We're gonna undecorate him. You removed the box of non-dog-related raisins. That's a little better. See, he likes when we undecorate. Because I think all those decorations are weighing him down, honestly. Gift Trot is slightly less irritated. Undecorate again. You remove a small, confused dog. Nice. I guess we gotta get that candy cane, too. Why are you attacking me if I'm helping you, you dumb Gift Trot? Okay, let's get rid of that candy cane. The striped cane that says, I use this tiny cane to walk on it. Oh my god. A weight has been lifted. Are you gonna attack me? Oh, he didn't attack me. Let's go. Spare him. Alright, so that's how we deal with that guy. You just gotta take off all his decorations. I think I remember this door. This was like one of those secret places that you had to access later on in the game, I think. Yeah, it's like one of those locked doors. Oh, you can turn these on and off. What? Is there a pattern? Do I have to turn them on in some specific way? It's a door. Okay, thank you. I knew it was a door. How do I get through it? Okay, yeah, I think this, this area is useless for right now. I mean, I could have tried those, uh... Whatchamacallit? Those glowy thingies, because there's only what? Um... 24 combinations? No, that's not right. It's four... Shoot, what is it? Two to the four? Yeah, it's 2 to the 4, which is uh, 4, 8, 6, 
that's not right. Four times four, right? I don't know. Forget my math. Can I get the... Where's the 30 gold? I want the 30 gold. Nope, there's... I know there's 30 gold in one of these, but we probably have to read every single one first. Gotta search all the snow puffs. Ready? This last one's gonna have gold. Hey, called it. Let's go. Got 30 more gold. What? A tiny doghouse? Woof. Woof, woof, woof. Alrighty, it is doggo fight time. We just gotta ignore him. Now we know. Ignoring makes him come close. Then we can pet him when he's up nice and close. I think we just gotta ignore him twice, I would say. And then he might be close enough for us to pet. In that room, if you have the game for the PS4, you can enter in that door, but I don't remember how and when. Well, you can enter through any game, I know that, but I know you basically have to come back before finishing the game. Like, you have to get to the end of the game and then come all the way back, I'm pretty sure. And I think it's just some dumb, like, dog easter egg, honestly. Alright, no, 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 no. I can't, I can't move. My stupid, my analog stick is not working on the PS4 today for some reason. Odd. Okay, let's ignore you once again, bring him in closer. Ah, what? I was not moving. Give me, uh, nice cream. Perfect. No barks. No barks. I refuse. Okay, Kim just wants affection. Perfect. I think you're close enough to pet. Weeder doll curls up in your lap as if it, as it is pet by you. It gets so comfortable it falls asleep. Z. Then it wakes up. It's so excited. Don't hurt me, doggo! You hurt me. Patting the crown with its front paws. Oh no, that did not work. I guess he needs more affection. More affection it is. Let's play with him. You make a snowball and throw it for the dog to fetch. It splats on the ground. Greater Dog picks up all the snow in the area and brings it to you. Now Dog is very tired. It rests its head on you. Yes. Sweet. Uh, okay. Wants some tender love and care. Let's give him some. Let's, uh, let's pet him. As you pet the dog, it sinks its entire weight into you. Wait, this is a big dog. I don't want its entire weight on me. That, that's a lot. Your movement's slow, but you still haven't pet enough. <laughs> of course I haven't. Ah, shoot! He's tricking me! Pet him again. You pet decisively. Pet capacity reaches 100%. The dog flops over with its legs hanging in the air. But you're still attacking me- Oh my lord. Come on, doggo. You gotta be kidding me. Alright, uh, that is where we're going to end Undertale for today. But I think it was some, some good progress for our first day. Hopefully uh, we can make it even further on our next playthrough of it, which will probably be either Saturday or next Wednesday. Uh, it, Mastro, if you're heading out now, just, you, uh, just so you know, you can stay up to date with the stream in the Discord in the uh, schedule and updates uh, window. I usually try and post my week's schedule in there every time. Um, you said an important thing. That you will know when you're going to do the true pacifist run. The sentence was, I refuse. <laughs> I refuse to hurt these people. It will not happen, I promise. Okay, um, let's just save once again to be, to be safe. Okay, and I believe I can just go ahead and quit now. So, let's do that. And we will switch on over to Fall Guys.